Bridgeport.com. Hi there, welcome to Turner Classic Movies. I'm Ben Mankiewicz. We hope you're enjoying this first day of 2015 as we continue our marathon of Marx Brothers comedies. We just watched Groucho, Harpo, and Chico Marx wreak havoc in the opera world in A Night at the Opera. And in their next movie, they tackle the medical profession. From MGM in 1937, it's a day at the races. Groucho stars as Dr. Hugo Z. Hackenbush, a veterinarian who, thanks to his wealthy longtime patient, played by Groucho's favorite straight man, Margaret Dumont, finds himself the head of the Standish Sanitarium, a fancy name for a hospital for rich hypochondriacs. Unfortunately, the bank is about to foreclose on this sanitarium, but never fear, thanks to a racehorse, a jockey played by Harpo, and a racetrack tipster played by Chico, the boys can save the day and at the same time promote a romance between the sanitarium's pretty young owner and a handsome singer. The plot generally followed the same formula devised by MGM studio head Irving Thalberg for A Night at the Opera. Thalberg had what seemed to be an uncanny sense of what audiences liked best about the Marx Brothers in their movies. So what he did is he'd send the brothers out on a live tour to try out material for a night at the opera. And then he repeated that for a day at the races, sending the boys out on a 6,000 mile road tour to theaters to try out material on live audiences. They'd go so far as to pass out comment cards for audiences to write down their favorite lines and their least favorite. Sadly, three weeks into filming, Irving Thalberg died unexpectedly, a devastating loss to Hollywood at large, and the Marx Brothers in particular. They'd lost a great friend and their great champion at MGM. The film, though, turned out great. Groucho called a day at the races his favorite Marx Brothers film and his favorite role. Also starring Maureen O'Sullivan and Alan Jones, here's a day at the races. <laughs> 